Hello, I'm Louise and in this video I'm going to show you all the tools that you'll be using in the Edible Playground. For each different tool I'll show it to you first, then I'll tell you its name and how to use it and then I'll demonstrate how to use it safely. So watch really carefully because you'll need to remember this for when you're using the tools yourselves. Now your teacher might want to pause after I show you the tool and then you can maybe try and answer some of the questions yourselves. Let's get started. What do you think this is and what do you use it for? Did you get it? It's a spade and you use it for digging or maybe moving things around. You can break up the soil with it and perhaps plant larger things like fruit trees. So put your hand on the top of the spade, put your foot onto the shoulder of the spade, press down using all your body weight through your foot, move your hands, pull back and lift the soil. What about this? What do you think it's called and what's it for? Did you get it? It's a fork and you use it for breaking up the soil also for digging and moving things. Similar to the spade, put both hands on the handle of your fork and your foot on the shoulder. Then push down with your body weight. You might want to wiggle it a bit. Then pull back, and move your hands as well. And you get these big clumps of soil you might want to bash them a little bit but don't lift your head of your fork higher than your knee because that could be dangerous. Now this one's a little bit trickier. Can you guess what it's called and what you use it for? It's called a hoe and this is a Dutch hoe. Now you use it to remove weeds from in between your vegetables. Did you get it right? You use the blade of the hoe to cut or uproot the weeds from their roots. It's best to use it when the soil's dry and on a sunny day so the weeds dry out before they can root again. What do you think this is? What's it called and what do you use it for? This is a garden rake. You use it to level the soil but also to make the surface of the soil into a cr fine crumbly texture perfect for planting your seeds in. Put both hands onto the handle and you can push the soil to make it more level. You might want to break up some of the big lumps but again be careful not to lift the head of the rake above your knee. What do you think these are called and what do you use them for? This is called a trowel and this is a hand fork. You use them for similar things, for digging, for planting seeds and other plants and also for digging up weeds. When you're using a hand trowel, you put the blade into the soil if you're digging. Use it to pile the soil next to your hole. Just put some water in there and 
pop my strawberry in. You can also use your hand trowel to push the soil back into the hole around your plant. You can use it to pat it down as well or use your hands. To remove weeds, put the blade of the hand fork onto the soil, push down. You can use both hands and give it a wiggle. Then pull up. This is especially good for weeds with big roots. So now you know all about the tools and how to use them safely. Here are just a few other things you need to remember to keep you and everybody else safe in the edible playground. Always wear sensible shoes and clothes depending on the weather. Never use anything that seems damaged or broken and if you find anything like that, make sure you tell your teacher. Make sure you have plenty of space around you when you're using any tools so that you don't hurt anybody else. If you're carrying any tools around, make sure that you keep the sharp part or the dangerous part of the tool lower than your knee. And just like scissors, never run with any tools. If you're not using your tools, make sure you store them safely. Digging tools can be pushed into the ground and left there, or other things need to be put away out of any paths where people might trip. Lastly, make sure you clean off your tools properly before you put them away. Hopefully now you're confident to get out into the garden. Stay safe and have fun. <laughs>